We have some very nice, tasty bubbles open if you would like a bubble. It is method traditional. It is bubbles. <laughs> have that many bubbles in it but they are pretty on my tongue it does it oh. disappears yeah so how does champagne actually get the it is carbonated no it just naturally has bubbles yeah how does that how so it must be kept under pressure temperature there must be something pressure in the bottle final fermentations in the bottle and it's flat when it goes in the bottle so you make a base wine mm -hmm. and you um, bottle it and you dose it with yeast Mm -hmm. stuff in the bottle mm -hmm. and then you put it in its final bottle but with like a beer cap on it got it and it doesn't just pop the beer cap off no okay. but it's fermenting right you've added this extra yeast enough so it's fermenting and then you lay it down for however long you lay it down with the beer cap on yep like that and that's what's known as being entourage why on, what is it? tirage is oh on tirage not yes. entourage yes on yeah. tirage you lay it down generally for at least two years. Mm -hmm. It's kind of minimal, I think. I guess some people do it less. Our highest end wine is five, six years that you just leave it okay. in that bottle and let the yeast do its thing and it creates the bubbles. And it, because the bottle cap, it has enough pressure in it. Because normally when yeast things, they create bubbles like bread, it creates bubbles. And at some point the bubbles expand and go off into the ether. You so may notice pressure. that the glass of champagne bottles is quite heavy. Yeah, that's because of the, because of the pressure. So then, when you're ready to disgorge it, mm -hmm. you have a machine, you, free, you turn the bottles upside down, keep them upside down so all that yeast and all that crap that's in there falls into the neck. You freeze the neck of the bottle, uh -huh. and they put through a machine that pops the cork and pulls the plug of frozen dead yeast stuff. Mm -hmm. They dose it with a little bit, sometimes a little more sugar in it, some whatever, and put the champagne cork in it. Got it. I just want to say this is really tasty. It's really good. <laughs> <laughs>